Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the WWE Slam Zone 24-7 is finally time for a change. And another change will happen at Showtime as well. But ladies and gentlemen, I am the A-lister, your reigning, defending, undisputed champion. That's right. I am the G... Wait a second. This is for the WWE Slam Zone. Oh, that's right. Travis, you lost your company. You lost everything that belongs to you. And this anonymous person, he's going to show up at Showdown, Showtime's uh, Summertime Showdown next week. And you might want to be prepared. But ladies and gentlemen, I am your undefeated, your reigning, defending WWE Slam Zone, undisputed YouTube's podcast world's heavyweight champion. And you see, I have to come on here to do a video for the 24-7. Well, we're going to do some WWE news, and then we're going to... I've got a few words for my opponent at next week's pay-per-view. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, this here is from uh, WrestlingInc.com. Uh, this is about updates on that WCW Nitro will be airing on the WWE Network this fall. Uh, here is the following statement. Triple H, Stephanie McMahon, and George Barrows participated in the Needham Fireside Chat event in, Nor in New York City on Tuesday and revealed that WCW Nitro episodes will be aired to the WWE Network beginning this fall alongside the Monday Night War series. Um, let's, see, uh, let's see what else. We, but yeah, that is pretty much it. Uh, but other WWE no, uh, no, news, uh, WWE Hall of Famer ha is having... Sur um, we have noted later, late, uh, late last week that WWE Hall of Famer Harley Race Fell at home, uh, fell at home, and was forced to miss the Mid Atlantic Wrestling Fan Fest in Charlotte. Um, Harley Race was examined by a doctor, and it has been confirmed that his extreme pain was coming from a zist on his spine. I know how he feels because that's what I had when, um, in 2009, I had the same surgery he's having right now on his spine, being a, a, a gravitated. Uh, Harley Race underwent a three-hour surgery on Monday to remove the cyst. Fans can send send their get well letters to Harley Race. They have a um, they have a um, an address that you can send a letter. But uh, yeah, um, the first part um, I really would love to see WCW Nitro be put on the WWE Network. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna be holding my belts because these ain't going nowhere by next week. But uh, yeah, um, it feels really happy. I'm really happy to see now that WCW Nitro will be aired on the WWE uh, Network. Uh, we're gonna also be there was also rumors I think on WrestleZone that there's gonna be also old WWF Raw's War uh, shows. So I cannot wait to see that. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is, you know what? This is the WWE. Uh, this is the WWE Slams on 24/7. I got a few words that I want to talk about. Prodigy Snake. That's right, Prodigy Snake. This week, you and I, we are going to go mano y mano. You and I are going to have a debate. You and I, you and I can see this was scheduled. This is scheduled by the useless boss. That is no longer your GFW Wrestling Fan Zone boss. And that's... Travis Neely. See, Travis Neely, you are no longer the boss of this company. Whoever it is going to be coming next week, <laughs> your company is going down the drain, Travis. You lost the company. And this is your fault. Your fault 
that you lost the GFW Wrestling Fan Zone, and now it's now known as the WWE Slam Zone. It is now owned by my. Uh, it is now owned by Billy Bob. But, ladies and gentlemen, next week you are about to bear witness the reveal of the co-owner of this company, the man, the anonymous, this anonymous guy. He called me later today. He called me over the phone in a private chat that next week he will be revealed. This man will be revealed next week. So I don't care if this is the WWE 24-7 where I have to talk about news. The boss, the real, co the other person, the anonymous man told me to tell you fans and to tell you Travis Neely. You're going to be in for the shock of your life coming next week. So ladies and gentlemen, that is it for yours truly, Michael Miner. The reigning, defending, undisputed, greatest at its greatness, Michael the Axe. Oh no, 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 it's Michael the A-lister, Miner, because you see, I am your WWE Slam Zone Undisputed YouTube's Podcast World's Heavyweight Champion and come at sh uh, sh Summertime Showdown there is no way and I mean no way that Prodigy Snake is going to beat me so Prodigy Snake if you're watching this I'm going to get a little closer you better listen, you better listen, you open all you better open your ears. Come next week, I'll still be champion. Come next week, you will be useless. But for right now, this weekend This weekend is your pay per view knockdown. <laughs> I hope to God you lose that 20-man battle royal because you are number one in that pick. I heard from an anonymous source that you're going to become number one in that battle royal. Because you see, once you lose that Revolution's World Heavyweight Championship, you are going to prove to everyone, to the fans, to every person, including me, that you're nothing but nobody because once the next pay-per-view comes up next week you won't be champion I will still be greatest at its greatness so I thank you fans the WWE Slam Zone go down in the description and subscribe to yours truly's channel and don't forget later on tonight ladies and gentlemen don't forget to join me and to join CM Styles to see CM Styles is hosting the Indie Spotlight. Your champion is going to be part of that show, and that is the Indie Spotlight, where we, where um, CM Styles is going to interview Latin Dragons. The Latin Dragons. I cannot wait to see this. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am the A-lister. And there's not a darn thing that Travis or Prodigy Snake or anybody or even the newcomer, this newcomer, Jacob McGovern. Really? You have to bring Jacob and you have to bring Scott Casey Gale into this, Travis? That's okay. You ruined my show? <laughs> I'm going to make sure that next week you ain't gonna never ever have a show again now cut the video